What's inside of Amazon's new $5 billion headquarters in Virginia? The world's leading marketplace, Amazon, has been working on its new headquarters since the start of last year. It was the year 2013 when Amazon first announced that it plans to build a second headquarters in the country. Immediately, hundreds of offers flew in from different cities and representatives for Amazon to choose their land. But at last, Amazon picked New York for its latest endeavor. Let's see what happened next. But before we get started, don't forget to subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon for more amazing and interesting videos like this one. Watch the video until the end to know what's inside of Amazon's new $5 billion headquarters. Right after Amazon made this announcement of picking New York for its latest endeavor, they had to change their decision due to the ongoing protest in the city. After this, Amazon picked Arlington, Virginia to be the location for its grand headquarters. The preparations began as early as 2019, and recently, according to the Amazon press release, the futuristic workplace will be operational by the start of 2025. This is a huge project, and it's said to bring in a huge amount of $2.5 billion over the next decade in Arlington. Along with this, the project is also set to create over 25,000 jobs and improve the local infrastructure and living style. There is no question why the people of Arlington gladly accepted this proposal, as it boasts a secure future for them. However, what's more intriguing is the fact that what is in Amazon's new headquarters? Well, Amazon has come up with a completely different and new approach. The world's leading business giant hired their professional designing company, MBBJ, and they have introduced a unique design of the building, which is being called the Pin Place. NBBJ has taken this project quite seriously and has constructed a special office in Virginia just to be closer to the site. The Pin Place focuses on a unique concept of mixing nature into the working environment. The designers and creators have focused on the mental health and well-being of the workers, and seeing the latest trend in working from home, they have planned to provide them the working space much similar to the one they would have at home. Consisting of 2.8 million square feet of office space and 2.5 acres of public space, Pin Place is said to have four giant buildings. Three of them are huge office towers. However, the one that got the most attention and liking of the public is the central giant double helix structure. This giant tower is made entirely of glass and is covered by greenery and plants. Amazon representatives explain that the helix structure is to further emphasize the mixture of nature into the working environment. By providing much healthier and fresh working conditions, the workers will be able to enjoy themselves while producing the best results. It is good to see such a giant company taking mental health seriously. Along with this, they are also pushing on the fact of saving trees and nature. The Helix is expected to have two walking paths that will be spiraled up from the outside of the building. Being covered in greenery, the Helix will be a major tourist site, and according to Amazon officials, the site will be accepting visitors on the same days of the week as well. This feature is also set to boost the tourism number of Arlington, Virginia. The double Helix is itself a symbol of nature, as it is present in plants, DNA, and the universe. The Helix can be compared to the present structure outside of Amazon's Seattle headquarters. There, it contains three spheres, connected and covered in greenery. However, the Helix is a much bigger and adventurous project. That sounds crazy! Along with the giant Helix in the middle, the headquarters will also contain three giant buildings of 22 stories each. It is these buildings where the workers will be situated and the workspaces will be, as Amazon plans to turn the Helix into a more recreational and relaxing stop, where the workers can sit, have a cup of coffee, and relinquish the beauty of nature. Along with these, they can also use the spot for a temporary workspace. The three buildings will also contain the warehouses and the meeting areas. Another crazy feature of this headquarters is the fact that there will be purified air and the employees will be able to breathe fresh green air like they would in a forest. Along with this, the buildings are designed in such a way that it allows natural light to come inside and give the employees a much more natural feeling. Now, let's be honest, who would not want to work in a place like this? 
Furthermore, along with showcasing nature in all of its elusive design, this entire headquarters will be run completely by renewable energy. It will be powered by a huge solar system set up which is being arranged 200 miles away from the original site and the electricity will be brought to the location through cables and wires. Along with all the businesses and office buildings, the designers have allocated huge acres of area for the public and other use. The building is set to have parking of more than a thousand bicycles and will have different electrical charging spots installed all over the place. Also, different coffee shops, small restaurants, and cafes are to be put up in the vicinity. Not only this, but a 2.5 acres of public space that even includes a path to walk dogs. The huge public space will also contain a space for concerts, which can host a crowd of up to 250 people. The nearby streets across the buildings will be having protected lanes for bikes, and the buildings are set to have bike entrances as well. The designers hope to build underground parking for cars, which will end up making the streets safer and quicker for the pedestrians and bikers. Well, the project is expected to be finalized around 2025. By the initial looks of it, the pen place looks a calm, soothing place to work in. Anyone would love to be a part of the workforce that operates here. However, we don't know what happens in the future. But let's hope the project goes exactly according to the plan. Both meant to infuse nature into this place, but also is inspired by nature. Quite interesting for us as designers to really explore that and, and push that as far as we can in terms of how that building is designed and built. It's a place that people are going to want to travel to as a destination. These are long-term investments. These buildings aren't opening until 2025, and I'm very hopeful that we will be in a much different place by then. This is about where we wanted to be in terms of submitting our 4.1 plans. And he says the pandemic has not disrupted the construction of Metropolitan Park nor hiring employees. The company says it will hire 25,000 employees for the Arlington headquarters. And since making the announcement more than two years ago, 1,600 people have been employed. Well, that's all for today. Before going anywhere, don't forget to like and share the video if you find it interesting. Also, subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon for more interesting videos. Until the next video, stay tuned.